I'm Alex Basil Trapper, here for the 11 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. Just finished my show, the Tiger, T uh, Tiger Technicians Hour, 10 o'clock to 11 every day. My service is the opening call daily newsletter. So let's get to the Dow down 144, but Amgen in the Dow is down 15 points. What a slump. So that's taking its toll there. Let's go back to the Dow, and I'll just mention a couple of things, and I'll talk about it again tomorrow. Uh, we've got a chance of what we call a chapter wave instant restart. We're within three bars after the fourth highest peak, peak D. It goes to an E. What happens next? We'll t discuss that uh, in my show again tomorrow. I did it today I'll, and yesterday, and I'll do it again <laughs> tomorrow, unless there's a big spike to the upside. I don't think there will be. Let's go to the S&P all-time high. Down all-time high, S&P all-time high. But just a nominal look at these tiny candles. All-time high with a candle that looks like the speck of a dot. That is really unusual. So I'm watching this closely because we're starting to lose some upside momentum, but it's at 57.33.85, up 95. And uh, the weekly chart is still very strong. QQQ did go to that leg, missing leg D. Uh, it's up $1.35 at 486.72. Good action. Uh, all the technicals are strong in the daily, weekly, monthly. IWM is lagging a little bit. It's coming back a tad. And uh, no, it's just kind of stuck down a dollar thirty-five at two hundred nineteen seventy-eight. Um, yeah, the technicals are quite good, but the price just doesn't want to break out into the. It's at two nineteen. It needs to get to the two twenty-six area by Monday at the latest. All right, let's get to the gold. Gold had a spectacular rally to all-time highs. It's at two six eight two right now, up almost six. Um, a leg E. A, D, a leg D in the uh, weekly chart and a leg C meaning in the Chapman wave it should go still to a fourth highest peak at some point in 2024. That's very strong action. Bonds, oh, this is a, uh, I mean, I don't know what the Fed is thinking here. The Fed talks about lower rates and yeah, we've got higher rates. Uh, the, the Fed, the uh, the bonds are down 1930 seconds at 124 and a half. This is not great. Uh, it's, they're not breaking uh, up. But they are moving higher rates. And if you look at crude oil, crude oil sort of stalled. It's down 70 cents at 70.87. Uh, this is okay action. It should be much stronger. It's not. So crude oil is not acting all that well. So Steve Rose uh, recorded his show earlier this morning. Uh, but it will be coming back now for the next hour. A great show as always. And wonderful programs here at TFNN. Check them out. Stay tuned. And I will be back tomorrow. Check out my opening call, Daily Newsletter.